guys welcome back to another week of Bella's lunches if you're new welcome uh, my name's Amy I think I forget to say that quite often and a lot of you don't know my name my name is Amy uh, Bella is my daughter and I'm making her lunch so she actually requested quesadillas and all I have are these gross multi-grain tortillas so, she's just going to have to suffer. They're not gross. They're just not our favorite tortilla. Like, I will never buy them again. I just think that they cook weird or, you know, like heat up weird. But, anyway, this is how I'm making her quesadilla. Uh, not very fancily. I'm actually going to just put it in the microwave because she does not like it when it's crispy. So, I just take the tortilla put cheese on it, microwave it for about 25 seconds, <laughs> and it comes out looking like that. And then I take my other gross tortilla. Again, they're not really gross. But see how it's kind of like not really melted there? It will melt. And then I flop it onto this side and onto here like this. And then it kind of just like heats the bottom one. So I'm going to set this aside and let it kind of melt together. She's going to get an egg. Easy. She's going to get some pineapple chunks. Again, easy. Some chickpeas. This was suggested. I don't know if it's the same person suggesting it or if it's a few of you suggesting it, actually. But pepperoni and cream cheese. Whoa! Almost knocked you over. So, pepperoni and cream cheese. And you say to just get some cream cheese, put it on the pepperoni. I thought this would just like be a fun snack, actually. And fold it in half. And then she has these little bite-sized pepperoni snacks. So if you make these, tell me, am I doing too much, too little? What's the ratio on the cream cheese? I'm going to kind of make them a little bit different on each one and see which way is her favorite. But I had this like minuscule amount of cream cheese left and I thought, you know what, I'm just going to make those um, cream cheese snacky things that I've been reading in the comments for so many weeks. Am I even doing this so you can see it? I hope so. I didn't know how many pepperonis I just grabbed. I'm just going to do all of them. I mean, all of them that I grabbed, not the entire package. Oh my gosh, I'd be here for 500 years if I did the entire package. All right, they're cute. Stick those in there. Adorable. Okay, now let's cut up our case a deal. So I have all these decorations. I keep them in this Brill Idea box. I've talked about it a few times, but I love it for the sections. For if you're like packing your lunches, this is another great way to like separate your food. They sent me a ton of decorations, or decorations, a ton of boxes um, at the beginning of the school year. Let's do some sunglasses. Like I'm kind of like, beachy mood today. What else can fit in there? Maybe I'll fit this like right in the top. Like that. I'll have to take it out when I close it. But it'll be cute for the picture. <laughs> but in real life, this will fold lay down this will lay down this I'll just take out and just line it next to it and she still likes getting them even when it's not in there when she actually opens her box if it's not like in the egg she's okay with it she'll eat it like this she'll stab it in there see where I'd put it in because when she takes it out she'll see the line I'm not even kidding she'll put it back in and then she will eat it like this I didn't know she did that she told me maybe she said it in a video actually 
you guys remember her saying that? Anyway, there's so much. Hey guys, good morning. I'm making Bella's bre breakfast, uh, lunch in front of you right now. Uh, I'm making Bella's lunch in the morning because again, she's taking a thermos meal. She's taking leftovers yesterday. We had pasta with onions and mushrooms and tomatoes in it. I don't see any tomatoes in her pasta though. So let me just scoop some in. And oh my gosh, look at this gigantic pepper. Do you want him? Okay, I'm gonna send her two peppers. <laughs> you guys, look at this lunch. Look at this lunch! All right, so we're gonna do chickpeas. I feel like I wanna pack her chips. That's what I feel like. Oh, it's not even centered, what the? Come on. I feel like I just wanna pack her chips. Do you want chips? Yeah. No? <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, this is going to be her lunch. Pasta, chickpeas, two peppers, and some applesauce. This is a boring lunch, but you know what? It'll be tasty, won't it, Bella? All right, today's lunch. She is getting a ham sandwich. Is that the meat that I have? Yeah, ham. Uh, and a little bit of butter on one side only. A star. Don't we all want to be a star? So here's the star. It kind of cuts it in half. So it doesn't look like a star once it goes in my box, but it was a star. Um, I'm gonna send a little pepper. Oh, I was gonna cut into this avocado. I don't know if it's still good. Usually I just throw them into my fridge as soon as they start ripening and then they get really dark in my fridge and it's hard for me to tell if they're still good or not. But typically they are perfect. Let's see, we'll find out together. It's perfect. I love doing that. But it's sometimes it's kind of scary. It's like, what are you going to get? I'm going to throw it into here. And I think I'm just going to give her half. Just kind of scoop it out. Just give her half of a avocado. Um, I did that last time and she said it was just fine. I did put a little bit of lemon juice on it. Um, I don't like doing too much because I don't want to make it soggy, but I will add just a little bit to here. I have a bowl of lemon juice that is ready. Let's do some chickpeas in the center again. I feel like I've done that again this week already. What should we put up here? Oh, let's do an apple. Can you see this thing at all? This is my apple peeler. And the brand is Pampered Chef, in case you care. I don't know. Um, this thing right here is really sharp. That's the cutter, and then that's also the cutter. So I'm kind of trying to be careful. You just put a nice, clean apple onto these little spiky things. So all that you do is you just kind of hold this board steady. I don't have a counter right here where I can show you it. Otherwise, you can clamp it onto your counter. But then all you do is just spin it. Perfect. And I take these skins, the skins, the peeling, whatever it is, drop that into my bowl of lemon juice as well as this. See, now my apple is just peeled and deliciously ready to go. So, up top, I'm going to give her, I think I'll just give her the skins today. Does that look weird? Maybe I should put one little apple half Like this and then I'll probably just snap it in half and just lay the two halves in there 
I mean, this whole lunch is just ridiculous looking. So, and then I'll save these apples for later in the week, or she can have them for an after school snack. But anyway, that is her lunch. All right. Hey, hey guys. <laughs> We just get started right in there. Um, Bella is going to take a hamburger to lunch today. So, tomorrow, whatever. Um, I have this hamburger. It's left over from dinner. I'm going to be putting this in a thermos in the morning. So, it's not really going to be like in her lunch. But the bun will be. So, the bun will be right here. And then, I think I'm going to pack her some apples. Let's do some spinach. Okay, and then she wanted a hard boiled egg again today. It's not gonna fit. I think I might have to fit it here. Unless I fit the spinach there. Hey spinach friends, can you fit right here? Oh yeah, I'll just smush him down. She doesn't care. Let's fit the egg there. What else should I pack today? Oh, you know what she said she wanted? More of these pepperoni guys. So, I'm gonna put some more of these pepperoni guys in there. Shoot, I wasn't recording. I put a beach ball in the bun. I put glasses in the egg. What else should I do? Flip flops? In the spinach? Okay. An umbrella? Is that just overdoing it if I do an umbrella over here? Ugh, I don't care. It's finally like starting to get nice outside. I'm kind of in the summery mood. Anyway, here is her lunch. Do you like this close up? You like when I do this? For a second, I forgot what day it was. Um. Those are her lunches for the week because I'm not packing her a lunch on Friday because we are going out of town for a baby shower. So it's gonna be a very busy weekend and we're gonna be out of town. So I wouldn't be able to get the video up because you know what I mean? You know what I mean, jelly beans? Anyway, this will be her last lunch of the week. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys have an awesome weekend. And I will see y'all later.